Hey, this is uh, Lynx Wind, and I'm going to report on this Nest Projects um, boost circuit. You can see here just how tiny it is. It's a bridge rectifier, two capacitors, and four diodes. And what it'll do is it'll triple the um, the voltage going into your battery at low RPM, low wind speeds. And once you reach uh, regular cut-in voltage, it'll bypass the um, circuit and just go through the bridge rectifier. So it's a clever little thing. And I'm going to hook up the wind turbine and show you what the voltage will do. So we're starting at 11.83 on this 12 volt battery. There's the little uh, Lynx, Lynx uh, mini gull. It was actually the first little prototype I made. And it takes a good wind to get it to 12 volts usually. So using this little circuit, it, uh, it doesn't have to spin up so fast to get to 12 volts. You can see it's kind of in the trees, but it's doing pretty good. All right, I've got the wind turbine hooked up. You can see the voltage is coming up. It's a real clever little circuit. Um, you can go to the Lynx Wind Forum, www.lynxwind.com, and then go to Forum, and you can see the um, schematic for this. I just twisted these components together. I didn't even solder them. So at this point, we're doing that low wind charging. When the wind kicks up, you'll see the voltage will jump to over 13. better view of it. So this is uh, set on amps. So you can see we're putting in 30 milliamps, that little turbine. Let's see how it'll track. So this is a nice little setup if you've got a sort of a, a low voltage alternator and you wish it cut in sooner. This will definitely do that and it will bypass at normal cut in and go direct to the battery through the rectifier. But you'll get some charging even, even when the winds aren't real high.